Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. A resource pool creates a single list of resources that can be scheduled amongst multiple projects. While helpful in almost any multi-project situation, it is especially helpful when scheduling multiple projects amongst multiple project managers in a networked environment. There are many benefits to using a shared resource pool for projects. When using resource pools, you only need to enter the resource information into the resource pool once. From there, you can link the resource pool to multiple other projects, called sharer projects, as needed. Another benefit is that you can view resource assignments from multiple projects in a single location. This also lets you more easily see over-allocated resources amongst multiple projects, even if a resource is under-allocated within a single project. These are just a few benefits of using resource pools. Before using a resource pool amongst multiple projects, you must first create the resource pool. This file is often placed in a shared network folder for ease of access between all project managers who need to link their sharer projects to the resource pool. Also, any project file can be used as a resource pool. However, it is most often a project file that contains no tasks, as the whole point of the file is to serve as a shared resource pool. Also, it is a good idea to save the resource pool with a file name that makes it perfectly clear that this file is a resource pool and not simply just another project file. After creating and saving a blank project file with the desired name, add the shared resources to the resource sheet view in the resource pool and save it. Then you link the desired sharer project files to the dedicated shared resource pool. You do this by opening the resource pool project file as well as the other project files to link to the shared resource pool. Within each sharer project file, then click the resource pool drop down button that appears in the assignments button group on the resource tab in the ribbon. Then select the share resources command from the buttons drop down menu. In the share resources dialog box that opens, select the use resources option button. Then use the From drop-down to select the name of the shared resource pool project file you have open. In the On Conflict with Calendar or Resource Information section, select the Pool Takes Precedence option to make the sharer plan use resource information from the resource pool over its own if there is a conflict. After setting the desired options in the Share Resources dialog box, click the OK button to apply them. You can then use the Shared Resource Pool to check for things like resource over allocations between project files that share resources. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.